Hey everybody, I just want to show you all what is on the menu today. I'm making spaghetti, so I have my ground beef right here, you guys. My jalapeno peppers. I have my onion here. Garlic powder. Crushed red peppers. Salt. The pasta. Then spaghetti pasta. And my spaghetti sauce. So, you guys, I'm going to season my meat, get it in my skillet over here, get it cooking. I already got my water on for the spaghetti. And I'm going to get back to you all with the finished product. Okay, guys. Toodaloo. Okay, everybody. I'm back. And I just wanted to show you all, you know, um, just a little bit more of what I'm doing. Okay. I got my ground beef here, you guys, in the bowl. All right. I like to put eggs in my ground beef. So I'm going to put two eggs in here, you guys. Okay. One and two. Okay. Now I'm going to go ahead and season this up. Like I showed you guys before with my garlic powder a little bit. A little bit of that in there. My crushed red pepper. A little bit of this in here, you guys. I'm trying to tilt the bowl so y'all can just see. A little bit of that, because I am putting a jalapeno in here, too. Okay. Some salt, you guys. Some little salt in there. Not too much, though. Not too much salt. And I have jalapeno here, you guys, that I'm going to just cut up in here. Okay. I'm going to cut it up. How you guys doing today? I hope well. Better than me, honey, because y'all see what I went through today. Ooh. <laughs> With the hair and the ghetto queens. So, yeah. But it's okay, you guys. I'm going to be okay. I already have some more hair or already had some more hair anyway because you just never know when you're dealing with unpredictables, you know, what's going to happen. So I do always have a plan B. Okay, guys, and I'm just going to slice this onion up in here. Okay. So, like I said, though, I was prepared, you guys. I really was because you just never know what you're going to be dealing with or whatever. Like I said, I knew the girl for a very long time, but I just, and I had knew that she did hair, but just didn't know that it was going to be such a bullshit job you guys total bullshit but it's okay like I said I handled it came out on the top too I guess she thought I was gonna be like oh my god oh my god my hair is looking like this oh my god life is over no honey I made that into a plus I made that negative right into a plus and put it on YouTube so she'll pay eventually <laughs> yeah okay guys so this is what this is looking like up in here all right, I'm gonna tilt it too much, but I'm gonna mix it up, you guys, and I'll be back when it's time to eat. To the loop. Hey, everybody out there, it's Adrian, and I am back with the finished product right here, you guys. My spaghetti. So I'm gonna eat. Let me turn it around a little bit. Okay, guys. Don't you guys know this home? <laughs> As everybody know this is homemade spaghetti and I'm just gonna get started you guys let me get comfortable you know you gotta you gotta adjust yourself sitting up here okay you get adjusted okay y'all look I just this was an old one honey so I just got it out baby and brushed it up a little bit hey it's not that bad huh but it's old but that's okay you guys let me taste the spaghetti okay 
because it's been a long time since I had some good spaghetti. I hope this is good. Let me see. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. It's good. Yum. Mmm. I just got a bit of um, either the jalapeno pino pepper or that crushed red pepper that I put in here. Yeah, y'all, this is an old, a oldie but goodie, honey. Just took a little brushing, like I said. Okay. And that girl really tried to do me. Okay, you guys. Ooh, so ghetto. But it's all right, though. You guys know what I winded up doing. This band ain't even. I ended up getting some coconut oil and the brush. And I took out like a little portion of my natural hair. Put the coconut oil on there. Brushed it in real good. Let the flat iron get really, really hot. And you guys, I just, I flat ironed my natural hair just to see where it was as far as the length and it's it's a pretty nice length you know I, you guys i got hair you know i got a lot of natural hair very thick my hair is extremely thick but um it's nice it's a nice length and i really just started to make an appointment to have it relaxed even though i just don't want to do it yet you guys i'm still trying to let it be natural in this natural state for a while you know and then I'll get it relaxed. Like, I was going to wait maybe a couple more months, then get it relaxed. Mmm. 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 -hmm. Definitely got a little kick to it, you guys. Wow. Mm -hmm. Definitely do. Mmm. But it's good. Mm -hmm. So anyway, you guys, I'm going to probably get my hair crocheted next week. I think Monday, next week, Monday, maybe. This band look crooked. So I'm... Anyway, y'all, uh, I'm going to work it out. But the lady that's supposed to do it next week, I talked to her. I sent her a picture of what I want, of, you know, the look I'm trying to achieve. And um, basically sent her a picture of how my hair was, you know, done by the other person. And um, just from the way she described how it's supposed to be put in, it, it seems like she really knows what she's doing. So I certainly hope so. But um Man, I, I just don't want it to be anything like it was, you know, this time, you guys. It was just so unnecessary. But at the end of the day, I have to be the bigger person. I, I don't have to be. But, you know, I, I just I just choose to be because I know sometimes when I say things, you guys, I, I can be mm, very direct. And kind of heartless. I mean, I, I've been called a lot of things, but I mean, I'm just, I just speak my mind, you guys. I mean, however I feel it is, is how it's going to come out. And that's just how I am. And I guess she just really got so upset. The girl that did my hair, you guys, I'm referring to. She really got so into her feelings and she was just so, so hurt and she was just so, so disrespected. But the bitch had my money at the end of the day. So, it's a whole bunch of game. But, you know, I am trying to be or was the bigger person. You know, I did apologize to her for, even though the only thing I really said was that it's enough hair on my head for, for, um, for three people. You know, I had never called her out of her name. 
and I had never, um, you know, uh, disrespected her by threatening her. See, to me, you know, where I'm from, you know, disrespect is a threat. You know, disrespect is calling somebody out their name. Disrespect is just running up on somebody and doing what you need to do. But this girl, it, she don't know the difference. She's young. She, she doesn't know the difference because none of the texts I sent her was disrespect. Now, this video, this is a direct hit. This is disrespect, okay? And it's directing your face. So, know the difference, sweetheart, in case you watching, because I am going to let people know in the family eventually to look, because your ass is on YouTube and you're blasted, and you know, it's, it is what it is, but you weren't disrespected before. I was being nice, but like I said, now this is a direct disrespect right in your face, and you know where I live, so come on back, baby. If you think that's what you uh, want to do, I welcome you right back. So, come on. Mm. Y'all, I didn't gave her too much life. Oh, y'all didn't see that. But I didn't gave her too much life because my damn spaghetti done got cold. So, mm. I'm going to end the video, you guys. In a couple minutes but I need to go warm this up I finished eating but um yeah you guys just try to stay away from garbage people you know that was really the um the meaning and the message I wanted people to get <clears throat> from the first video today but yeah you guys just try to steer clear of those type of people and don't let them drain you you guys because they will do it don't let them do it don't let them do it and people are so negative so just they just don't know any better i'm gonna chalk it up as that you guys okay so i will see you all in my next video um that's coming tonight so see you guys later i appreciate the comments